Oh, hi. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Um, today I will be reading Down to Earth episode 55 to 57. And here's a quick message to all my loyal viewers is that I am sorry for taking a very long unplanned hiatus. Honestly, I did not expect to, to be out for this long. Um, of course, I've taken on a new job role position at my company. I've been training, I've been studying and taking courses for my career. So I've been just so maxed out physically and mentally but now that everything kind of slowed down I'm able to have a better grip on my life right now so I'm excited to come back and react and read webtoons to you guys so if you guys out there who are new if you guys enjoy my webtoon reading style and reaction feel free to subscribe leave a thumbs up and I look forward to all and everyone's comments so further ado let's get started if you ask me what I remember from the last episode I read, and this is like episode 55, I would not be able to tell you. So uh, this episode will be a huge refresher for me. <laughs> ah. Hmm. Spinners. Oh, she's looking at the catalog. Oh yeah, I remember. C huh? Kate, good morning. Good morning. Thanks for letting me use uh, um, the bed while I'm sick. Thanks the stars. Oh yeah, he was recovering from a sickness. He was out in the rain, I remember now. You don't feel hot anymore. Uh, are you feeling all better now? Are you going to work today? Uh, yeah, I'm going to work. I'm so happy that you are back to normal. That really, really worried me. Thank you, Say. Uh, you did so well on your own. <laughs> also, thanks for, you know, caring. <laughs> Why would I not care? We're friends, are we not? Friends. He's about to break his own rules, because if you guys remember when they first met, he's like, No catching feelings, we are only roommates. Friends? Yeah. Of course, we're friends. <laughs> hmm. Oh, there is something I want to show you. <sighs> there is a woman in this book. <laughs> I wanted to ask if this was a really an earthling. If this was really an earthling. Huh? You think you found another alien? Well, she certainly looks different. Ah, here she is. I'm sure she's just, huh? What? No way! She's, she models for spenders? I had no idea. You know her? She's my co worker. Oh, I can never remember her name. Huh. Yeah, that will keep you warm. Huh. She's so pretty. So, her skin, is that common in Earthlings? It's not common. She has a rare skin condition called vitiligo. It's completely normal, though. I can tell you with confidence she's an Earthling. Oh, really? Then, if you could, would you ask her for some modeling advice? Uh, you're still thinking about that? Um... Yes. I just... Lately, I have been feeling more and more like a burden. I want to start a job, just like you. It would be nice if I could help you with payments. I want to feel independent. Uh, I understand how you're feeling. But I don't know if you're ready for that. What do you mean, not ready? You just praised me about how well I did on my own. Last night you said you were proud of me. You said I adjusted, adjusted so fast. And all of that is true. But you at least need to learn how to read. Keep studying like you are and you'll get there. 
Or you can let me use telepathy. Uh? You're worried about weird thoughts slipping out, correct? It's fine. It's not like I don't have thoughts like that myself. Uh, huh? We could just use to it, couldn't we? We just need to practice. Huh. Do you remember what you said last night? I'll tell you. But only if you tell me more about yourself. Like stuff about your planet and why you ran away. Show me a memory with Delilah. And I'll show you a memory from my home planet. Huh? That would be so cool to be able to see what her world looked like. Down to Earth. Show me a memory of with Delilah. And I'll show you a memory from my home planet. Please? I wish to know more about you. It's just... Feels so intimate. Sharing thoughts like this. I, I don't want this to taint our friendship, you know? If you do not wish to do this, neither do I. But I want to know more about you too. Okay, I'll share. I'll share my favorite memory with Delilah. Ugh. Hey, wake up. The bell's about to ring. <laughs> uh, you gotta get a bit of drool, bro. <laughs> Here, want some lemon juice? It'll make- it'll wake you up. Uh, no thanks, Cherry. I've seen how you drink out of that thing. Lizard thin? <laughs> n not today. Well, there's one thing I know that will wake you up. Huh? Delilah was looking all over for you this morning. Seems super important. Huh? Uh. Shit, she got she gonna be mad. I wonder what's up. Huh? What could someone like her possibly want with someone like me? There you are. Where were you this morning? Sorry, I woke up a little late and rushed straight to class. Cherry told me you were looking for me. This is the last day of school before spring break. And you don't do everything you possibly can to be around me? I see how it is. Uh, sorry. I mean, we're all gonna hang out over spring break, right? You, me, Cherry, Cannon, and Dash. Ugh, it's, that's not the point! Anyway, I heard from a few people that you were seen driving to school. You got a, you got your license? Oh, that that's what this is about. Yeah, I got my prov provisional license because I'm 16. OMG, you could totally take us all out for lunch now. <gasps> or we could all go skating after school every day. Mm, no. Provisional license. I'm only allowed to drive myself to home, school, and work. And how's work at Burger Prince going? I thought about applying. Not the most fun place to work, that's for certain. But I'm making some money, so it's fine. That's so ad ad admirable. You're working so hard to be independent at so independent at such a young age. How inspiring. I think you're giving me too much credit. It's not that amazing. How modest. Hey, when do you work? When do you get off work? Um, around 8 tonight? Why? I want you to meet me at the playground around 9. 9? What for? But meet me at the playground. Around nine. Why nine? Such a, such a scandalous time. Meet me at the playground. Around nine. Hmm. Okay. 
<laughs> Kay. Hey, Kate. Huh? What was that about? Oh, hey, Dash. Don't know what y'all were talking about just now. <laughs> but she was giving you this look. Totally flirting. Huh? Um, hey, Cannon. Huh. Crap. Please. <laughs> um, Kate? If this is too difficult, we can... N no! I I'm I'm fine. Sorry, I didn't mean to think of that part. I don't know why I did. Should we take a break at least? No, 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 it's fine, really. I just didn't know I would see the memory so clearly. I want to continue though. I can do this. All right, but if you need to stop, then please don't hesitate. Okay, I, I won't. Relax and focus on one thing. Okay. I'll be back in a minute, Mom. In a bit, Mom. Going to the park. It's li this late? What for? Delilah wanted to meet up with me. Okay, honey. Just be careful, please. Did I get here too early? She... Huh? Huh? That is so creepy! Oh! <laughs> gotcha! Let's go play on the swings! <laughs> Why are we here alone anyway? Normally you invite everyone else. Plus, I wanted to talk to you alone. Isn't it nice, though? Dash isn't here to prank you, Cherry isn't here to be weird, Ken is not here being all grumpy. Uh, about Ken, I think he thinks you like me. Stupid, right? That's why he's been giving me so much shit. Could you maybe talk to him for me? Tell him that what's really going on? I, I really want us to get along. You're so dense. What do you think I called you here for? I'm confessing that I like you. <laughs> you dummy. Crap. 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 That is just so sad. Okay, for one, to bring up a very fond memory that Kate had with Delilah, you can only like, he can see it. Like at the same time, like their forehead touch, she sees what he sees and he sees it as if it's like a movie, right? And he's replaying his favorite moment of like with Delilah. And that must hurt because he also remember why it didn't work. You know, what happened, how they everything fall apart. So that's just so hard. Like for me, like to even think or recall like all the good memories I had with my former friends or exes or family members, like all the good times, but also remembering the, all the bad times. Like that's just... It just doesn't go well. Like it's always like when it comes to what happened in the past. Yes, there were good times, but but there were also bad times. So it's time to just for us to move on and not look back at it. You know, that's just hard, especially when it comes to like a breakup. You know, a fallout with friends or family. But when it comes to like a family member that passed who you love dearly, like I can sit there and I will cry, but be able to remember all the fond memories but that's like a different thing though to so remember a fallout you know it's, it's different anyways guys sorry for rambling if you guys enjoy my webtoon reading slash reaction feel free to subscribe leave a thumbs up and or drop some comments i'll catch you guys next time bye